What's up, guys? Quick game moments. I'm back again with more StarCraft 2 Wings of Liberty because I really like this game. It's my, like, like, look, this is, like, one of my favorite games. So, yeah, we're playing it. Uh, Tychus. You ever heard of a guy named Gabriel Tosh? Only rumors. Way I hear it, he was mixed up in some covert branch of the ghost program that produced some real scary badasses. Word was, Tosh snapped and went rogue. I'd play it real cool with that kind. He'd cut your throat soon as look at you. I've dealt with rogue ghosts before. It's the one still working for Menx I got a problem with. Alright, ghosts. Apparently he's a... Tosh is somebody we probably shouldn't be trusting, but who knows? Well, let's talk to the news. Hello, news. Donnie Vermillion, UNN. Your first, last, and only stop for the truth. Tonight, our own Kate Lockwell uncovers a secret shadow war waged by our brave Dominion ghosts against a ruthless hidden enemy. Thanks, Donnie. I'm talking live with a specialist in the Dominion. I understand that you and your comrades have been against a group of... What can you tell us about that? Well, Kate, I'm not allowed to say much, but I can tell you and his allies will not. We expect to them very soon. I think we'll all sleep a little better tonight, knowing our Dominion forces are watching over us. For UNN, I'm Donny Vermillion. I just realized there was a lot of talk about uh, ghosts after uh, you pick up Tosh, so maybe that's uh, saying something. Lab. The laboratory. What do we have in the laboratory? Hansen. Just out of curiosity, I did some tests on the minerals from Redstone. I thought you should know I found trace quantities of Jorium, a rare crystal with very unique properties. I'm all ears, Doc. What kind of properties? Jorium resonates at the same frequency as certain brain waves. It's been theorized that it could be used to stimulate brain activity or even produce psionic abilities in human subjects. What the hell does Tosh want that for? It's a great question. And. I, I like how they try to explain some of the stuff with science, but then again, it's just like, well, no. Uh, Swan's got nothing, so let's uh, let's look at the armory. What can we get? Oh, we can get some stuff for the base, but we got to get the infantry stuff first. I feel uh, we don't need the tech lab add-on with that, but I don't feel like that's something we need. I'm not gonna use fire bats a lot. It's pretty much gonna be marine marauder. So we're gonna uh, purchase that one because concussion shell, concussion, concussive shell. That was hard to say. Just that slow is what we need, really. Yeah, we really just need slow. Okay, bridge, bridge. You might want to talk to our new guest. Maybe ask him to leave my bridge. Why don't you do it? You're like the captain of the ship. Ah, he is the man. We make a good team, me and you. Why are you here, Tosh? Our business is done unless you got something else for me. Yeah, I got another job for us on a world called Belshia. Interested? Maybe. What's in it for me? Piracy ain't exactly my chosen path. Everyone knows Jim Rayner wants to put the hurt on Mengsk. I can help you with that. I can help you big time. I'll think about it. For the time being, welcome aboard the Hyperion. We'll talk later. Those white eyes without any pupils, they just, ugh. It's weird. It does have pretty cool hair though. I mean, just look at those luscious locks. Uh, what we got? What you got for me? Uh, wait, did we talk to everybody? I'm not sure we talked to everybody. Uh, nothing in the armory. We already did the bridge. We get the cantina. The lab was just... It's just Hanson, okay. That was uh, pretty quick there. I, I didn't expect it to be that quick. Uh, we should go to Meinhof. Jim, refugee populations from across the sector have been using Meinhof as a staging point. But with so many people in close proximity, an epidemic of some kind has started sweeping through the camps. Please, my people need help. We've got to do something before it's too late. Then let us do something. Before it's too late. Like, 9.30, that's pretty late. Yeah. It's like bedtime for me. So what are we looking at, Doc? 
That's a Our lot. readings indicate some kind of bio infestation is spreading through the refugee camps. Even the buildings are being covered by it. I've seen this kind of thing before. It's a Zerg virus. All we can do is burn it out. Every one of those infested buildings has to be destroyed. But where are all the people? Oh no. Those things are infested refugees? This is a nightmare. Yeah. This ain't good at all. It looks like they burrow underground by day and emerge only at night. The virus must make them vulnerable to the high UV output of Meinhof's star. Then we'll hit the infested buildings by day and protect our base at night. Don't worry, Doc. We'll contain this thing. Because of science, that's why. And here we go. We're on Outbreak. And this is uh, this mission. I remember it. The day-night cycle, which is only using this mission. It's actually pretty cool. Um, I'm not sure if I like it though. I mean, it does make a pretty cool attack defense pattern that you have to get used to, but after that, it's just it gets annoying after a point. So, right, ah, people, What's work, work, uh, build the tech labs because. Because uh, we can't get medics without the tech labs. So, what we want to do is build some bunkers pretty quickly here. Put like two bunkers here. Alright, boys. We can't risk the contagion spreading to this camp. I want a perimeter set and some bunkers in place now. Are you going sweet on that doctor, Lady Jimmy? Can't see why else we'd keep fighting for these damn dirt farmers. Now, do they really just farm dirt? That's the question. Is that something you can farm? And the second question is, how much money can you make off of it? The more important question. How much money can you make off of it? Uh, put some guys in there. I probably should have saved up for another bunker instead of that. Don't worry. It's fine. Not enough minerals. It's fine. Because now we got the bunkers. Got them bunkers going. Nightfall in 30 seconds. Ah, oh, crap. I don't like nightfall. Coming through. But it's okay. By it's our K. You gonna give me orders? Uh, we're kind of pretty close there, actually. You need to. You kind of need to finish up. Go ahead. You need to finish up. Get down there. And we might want to think about uh, upgrades. We gotta hold out till sunrise. Brace yourself. Yeah, let's drop down upgrades. Not enough minerals. Drop it down. Not we'll start mining minerals. gas pretty soon here. SCV ready. Yeah, but we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Don't worry. Please state the nature of Don't your emergency. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Uh, they were m massing outside. SCV it's fine. Ready. Don't worry about it. Just stop freaking out, man. Stop freaking out. It's game over, man. It's game over. They're the goddamn walls, man. The goddamn walls. Um, upgrade. Upgrades are always good. Yeah, yeah, we got this. Wow. He wants us to kill him. That's that's bad. It's not something somebody would say if they wanted to live. Just you know, because it's not. They want to live. They wouldn't say, "Please kill me." They'd say, "Please don't kill me," because that way they wouldn't die. Not enough minerals. Anyway, right? We're just gonna, yeah, just keep keep up SCV production. Should probably get some more more attacking units out instead of just workers, but it's okay. It's cool. It's cool. It's a good thing that these colonists aren't, I don't know, taking cover or shelter or anything. It's kind of, you know, eh. We do what we want. SCV ready. And yeah, we're we're gonna we, what's going we're gonna on? SCV up because they're not breaking that anytime soon. Go ahead and get upgrades going, and SCV we're good. Ready. We are just dandy, fine and dandy. Sure but we not do want to make sure that we keep getting supply depots. And yeah, these guys just not SCV even. Ready. Not even trying. 
Oh my god. Yeah, it'd be good if I had siege tanks. Just kind of put a siege tank... If you put like a siege tank like right here, that cover both ends. Like that would be a really good position. Or just like one right here, one right here. Those would work pretty well. Anyway. Other than proper siege tank placement, let's uh... Let's go fix that. And then we'll fix that. And we'll be fine. Upgrade complete. Just like I said. Whoa, what's this? Oh, Hellions. Hey, hot shot. I got schematics to build them Hellions you saw in Marsara. Should be good down there. SCV ready. Right, Base we're just gonna go ahead and start building uh, Hellions then. Because Hellions are pretty good against the ah, light Zerg. I mean, only is a really friggin' good job. light zerg. Right, where? What was going on? Up. We gotta hold on a little longer. It's okay. We can hold. Add on. Complete. We can hold for days. SCV just, just building, build more guys. It's fine. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Stop worrying. And like I said, you can pretty much just when it comes to this. Rise and shine, boys. Now it's our time to do some damage. To me, boss. When it comes to this, you can just Smoke mass it. up the one unit Ready that they give you, and you're gonna win. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. I'm just gonna mass up the. Uh... Is that some sort of nest? You better destroy it. No, it's not a nest. It's a. Okay, so it's a nest. And, uh, no, not the things. Not the broodlings. Kill it. Just, just win. Just win, okay? Uh, Hellions. And go over there. Just go. Just go. Why are, why are these guys hot keyed in? Okay, no, get back. Get back, stop it. What are you doing? Go ahead. Ready to raise some hell. And we'll go ahead and get that. Talk to me, boss. There we go. No, why? Okay. Actually, what I should do is, uh, there we go. Yeah, set up the rally points. Not and we're just going to spam Not enough Hellions. Not enough because, well, because we can't. Not enough minerals. And yeah, they're just gonna go ham like a sandwich. We could probably get more uh, unit diversity, but what? You have cars that shoot fire. Why would you not use them? Oh, that, that's a freaking evil looking. That's an evil looking uh, turret. Right. Um. Just keep Not building up. Minutes. Actually, I know what happens in this mission, so I'm going to cheat and just kind of anticipate. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna anticipate. I don't I don't remember when it happens. I just remember it happens. So yeah, we're doing that. Let's go. Finish killing them. And how close are you to being done with uh, plus one? I'm not detecting any more infested structures in that sector, Jim. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we should get some uh, fire bats for down there. And what do I want? Do I want war pigs? Yeah, let's get war pigs. And we also need uh, some more. Look, I just got such good macro going. Upgrade complete. I just don't need no. Like, pretty much, if this was multiplayer, I'd be in, like, Grandmaster by now. So, unfortunately, uh, it's not, uh, multiplayer. And I'm not in Grandmasters. So, yeah. But, you know, whatever. Whatever. They just have yet to realize how great I am at this game. So, yeah. Just chat. Not enough minerals. Looks like that sector's clear, Jim. Better move on to the next one. 
Good, good. I like sectors Metal. being clear. They're my favorite type of sector, unlike the dirty sectors. Uh, we're just gonna go in and do that. Just... yeah. Okay, hang on. There we go. Got plenty of things to kill. Yeah, we got this. Okay, yeah, let's get the heck out of here. I don't want to be caught out here in the middle of the night. Even though I could probably survive with the amount of guys I have. And... Uh, start bringing people in. For defense, because we're going to need defense, even though... I am incredibly cocky. I do know we will need defenses. They'll be coming again soon. And we should uh should repair. Scans are picking up a unique Zerg biosignature. It appears to be a burrowing creature that is underground during the day and emerges only at night. Sir, if you kill one of those creatures, Stedman can study it and perhaps learn something. It says kill one of them, but it says it, he said if you can kill one of them. Infested but that says two. Beans. Oh hell, Jimmy! I don't care for that notion one bit. I don't think anyone does. All right, let's get these guys up here and just kind of. Okay, wait. Get these guys out there. Hang on. Hang on. We're gonna figure this out. Go on. Okay, you know what? Everybody, just get back. Just get back. Hold position, I guess. Um, get over there. Actually, you can just do like this patrol thing. Where you just patrol. And if anybody is injured, then you go and heal them. That's a great idea. And more of those guys. More, uh, more Hellions. It's okay. Whoa, what the hell are you doing? That is not the patrol I told you to go on. Whoa! That one guy was just being pushed around. That was actually kind of funny. Stop attacking the base. Get out of his way. Okay, we got this. We're fine. Actually, get these guys up there. And you like hold position. You hold position. Aha! This should be good enough. That should work. Okay, we're good. We are good to go. We are definitely Base super good. Really awesome good. What's you need a freaking Okay, we're getting we're pulling we're pulling some messy beans. You guys up there, and we'll get another guy over here. And we we should be fine now. Now we are a okay. And look at look at just okay, look at the Hellions. The Hellion count is actually getting pretty ridiculous at this point. Not enough. Ah, uh, and then I run out of minerals. Not enough. Yeah, I hate it when minerals are just like not, not there, minerals. so I can't use them, and it makes me not sad. Ready to raise some hell. Some we have a lot of Hellions. <laughs> we have 37 Hellions. We probably go out there and do a lot of damage because these guys are light. Whoa. Are you ready for this? Okay, everybody. We're going this way. Okay, no, we're not going that way. Everybody, we're going out. We're gonna. Daybreak in 30 seconds. We're gonna clear out this way. And we're gonna win. We're gonna win. We are definitely gonna win this. What's happening over here? Nothing. We're good. Okay. That's why I stop. That's why I thought. Stop complaining. And daytime. Just move. Attack move over there, please. Don't forget. Please. You have to be back by dark. I don't have to though. I have 44 Hellions. So I could probably take a risk. Just saying, darling. And the Hellion counts just gonna get higher. And look, we're just kind of destroying them. Even though that you shouldn't be using Hellions to destroy buildings, these Hellions are destroying a lot of buildings. Yep. We win. We won. GG. 
What are you doing? Stop complaining and just kill him. Looks like that sector's clear, Jim. Better move on to the next one. Yep, just move it on. Oh hey. You're dead. And they also do all that like that little sp splash damage. That's nice. I'm in a heap of trouble. What do you mean you're in a heap of trouble? Stop being in trouble. Oh god damn it, did I? Additional supply depots required. Just there. Are you ready for Additional surprise was really. I am so good at this that I actually uh I I am out of supply. That's that's bad. I need more supply. Not enough minerals. Okay, supply, go. Go. Come. Looks like that sector's clear, Jim. Better move on to the next Yeah it is. And now we're good. Come on, once again, we are a-okay. Oh my god, kill the, kill the little broodlings, don't let them, don't let them come up in your face. Right, I, I, oh gosh. Boom, boom, no, boom, 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 okay. We've got a nice, uh, Rally point set up. Oh my god, kill the frickin' spine crawlers. There you go. They last frickin' forever. We almost, yeah, we're destroying most of the structures right now. And it's nice how, uh, I might actually beat this pretty soon here. Just kind of kill everything. Ooh, and there's a base down here. But I probably shouldn't be taking extra bases because, well, I don't know if I have enough to defend. So, you know, you don't want to take too big a risk. Like that sector's clear, Jim. Better move on to the next one. Well, that sector is definitely clear. Oh my god, just get through. I should probably not issue the move the attack command until we actually, you know, attack. Everybody go. Everybody just attack. 1A. I don't even use one as, as that hotkey. That's, like that's that a stupid clear, configuration. Jim. Better move on to the next one. Until the pros play. Shut up, Billy. Okay. That's what I need to do. I need to shut up. Absolutely. What do you know about the pros? Are you a pro? Yeah. Are you grandmaster? No. I'm not grandmaster either. But yeah. shut up. Hey, we're maxed out on life. This All right. This sector is clear. Nice work, boys. Now move on to the next area. No, not these guys. Ready to fry. No, not those guys. There we go. Let's go. Let us keep going. Man, we took out a lot of freaking. There are only 37 structures remaining. I could probably end this fairly soon here. I'm going in. in 30 seconds. Yeah, we're just gonna kind of rake this up. Just kind of clean it up. And you've dealt a serious blow to their numbers, Jim. You're doing great. Now I'm not taking any dangerous risks, but I am gonna get these uh infestors. Because at this point Keep your eyes Whoa. There's gonna be more of a map. Where'd those guys come from? Oh that sure pissed them off. Maybe we should wait for daylight. Hell no. And that infester has been torched. Yeah. It's a good thing that these uh, Hellions don't have friendly fire because uh, I'd, I'd have a bunch Some of Hellions on my hands. Um, I don't think they'll take down the debris then, actually, since I took out all the bottom. I might have accidentally won. Base is under attack. I might have won for that reason. Hey, how's it going? You're dead. <laughs> Go back. Uh, back to base. Or at least just kind of park. Absolutely. Actually, no, no, no. We're, we're gonna... We're doing this. We have, like... Yeah, we can do this. Mineral field depleted. Didn't show the aberration, though. Dang, it's... The, the frickin' hammers, they do 26 versus uh, armor. That's a... Uh... Seriously. You sure like staring up the hornet's nest. 
They do a lot, just saying. Those guys are dead. Oh, there's the aberration. What is that thing? Was it human? Probably not. And oh my god. Yeah, they're not coming down from below at all, are they? You guys up there defend, except for you. You down here. You're gonna help with that. And yeah, we we're just gonna base is under attack. We're gonna keep calm and not die. And those guys will come back. And these freaking best of marines just. It's like it reminds me a lot of the flood from Halo. Just yeah, this whole mission just kind of. It reeks of flood. Base Still got, we got two minutes. Two minutes. Nothing to worry about. And we definitely over our CV. It's okay, but while we wait, we can uh, very clearly uh, we can play with uh, play with the uh, spidey boss. Da 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 da. Okay. Now we're actually gonna watch the fight going on. Uh, not much coming up top. It's probably because I took out a lot. Definitely a lot over here. Yeah, they should have come over and taken out the bottom, but I destroyed the bottom before they could. I, I'm actually so good that I beat the game. Yep. Well, they mostly come at night. Mostly. But I killed them before they could. Right. Broken through the south barricade. Oh, hey. Troops down there now. I guess I didn't win. You know, I think I saw this in a movie once. What was the name of the movie? Uh, Alien in Space seconds. Dead 3? Word. Yeah. I don't know what I don't know what it was either. Alien Space Dead 3. Uh, coming to a theater near you. Uh, yeah, we're gonna. Under We're gonna just kind of help liberate the rest of these. Look. Oh hell yes! This is gonna be our time, all right. Look, we've got 24 structures left. I think we can do it within six minutes. Looks like that sector's clear, Jim. Better move on to the next one. And we got both infestors. So yeah, we just need to clean up. That's all we need to do right now, is just a little bit of cleaning, a little bit of spring cleaning, you know, it's always good. Just say a little bit of hygienic, a little hygienic. Oh, hey, and there's another base up here. I mean, if I really wanted to, I could probably take it. If I had the ability to make it a planetary, I would. You're almost done. There's just a handful of infested bio signs left. I'll highlight their locations on your map. Overall, this mission isn't that bad. I I, I actually liked this one when I start when I first played it. I was like, oh, this is uh, cool. It's cool, but uh, yeah. Once I realized that throughout this entire campaign, you just spam the one unit that you need, it, it kind of took strategy out of. Like, there's no strategy left in single player. Uh, that's just how the game is. You did it, Jim. I knew you wouldn't let us down. Now, I've got to get my people somewhere safe. Ain't gonna be so easy, darling. This whole sector's crawling with Zerg. There's got to be somewhere out there the aliens haven't touched. Some undiscovered paradise waiting just for us. Yeah, good luck trying to find your Valhalla there. Um, Some place the aliens haven't touched. The aliens have touched a lot of places. It's actually quite quite rude of them and yeah let's uh let's see what let's see what we got what we got what we got aboard the upside down o face of the hyperion what we got anything anyone anyone thanks for joining us our own Kate Lockwell is reporting live from the refugee ship Skinner 2 in orbit around the planet Meinhof. 
Donnie, the death toll out here is soaring. Massive refugee fleets like this one are struggling to reach the safety of the core worlds. Many of them won't. They're short on food, water, they and hope. They will discuss how the Dominion will rescue those worlds when we get there. There's a lot of talk about rescue among the refugees, but they're pinning their hopes on paramilitary and rebel groups such as Raiders... Great report, Ra Kate. Live from a refugee ship over Meinhof, where everyone eagerly awaits the Dominion's return. Up next, a Vermilion commentary. Refugees, are they really our responsibility? You're all heart, Donnie. All right, well, with that... Oh, like I said, when I said, I can make it a point if I could. Well, I, I can now, actually. Right. Anyways, with that, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more StarCraft II Wings of Liberty. Yeah.